Hello friends this is the next page of CodeIgniter 3 data encryption and decryption tutorial, and in this part we will display how can we fetch encrypted data from MYSQL table, and display in normal string form on web page by using CodeIgniter encrypt library. For this we have go to encryption decryption controller and under index method we have write dollar this with load object with model method and under this we have write encryption decryption model, this method will load this model under this function. After this we have here we have write dollar this with load object with library method and under this we have write encrypt. This method will load code igniter encrypt library under this function. Now we have go to encryption decryption model and here we have make fetch data function. Under this function we have write dollar this with database object with order by method with two argument like id and descending order. This method will add order by clause under query. Query, after this we have write dollar query variable is equal to dollar this with database object with get method and under this we have write sample data table name. This code will make query and execute query and store result under dollar query variable. Statement. Lastly we have write return statement with dollar query variable, it will return all data from sample data which an output of this function. Now again go to controller index method and here we have write dollar data variable is equal to dollar this with encryption decryption model with fetch data method, it will return all sample data table data and store under this dollar data variable. After this here in view method we have write dollar data variable in second argument, so by using this dollar variable it will fetch data on encryption decryption view file. Now we have go to encryption decryption view file, here we have make one table with five table column like first name, last name, age, gender, and edit table. Loop with, below this we have write for each loop with dollar data variable with result method as dollar row variable, here this result method will return query result data in array of object and which can be accessed by using dollar row variable. To dis in first table column we want to display first name data, so here we have write dollar row first name object. In second column we want to display last name data, so here we have write dollar row last name object. In third column we want to display age table column data, so here we have write dollar row age object. In fourth column we want to display gender data, so here we have write dollar row gender object. Data. And lastly we want to make edit data link, so here we have write anchor tag with href is equal to base url function slash encryption decryption controller slash edit method slash dollar row id object. In anchor text we have write edit, it will make dynamic edit data link for all data and it has send edit data request to edit method of encryption decryption controller. Now we have check output in browser. Friends this encryption decryption controller index method and here we have refresh web page. After refresh of web page, in table we can see sample table data in encrypted form, but we want to display in normal string form. So we have go to encryption decryption view field and here we have write dollar this with encrypt object with decode method, 
this method will convert encrypted data into normal string, this function we have applied to all encrypted data. Now friends we have again refresh web page and after refresh of web page, here on web page we can see encrypted data has been converted into normal string form, so this way we can convert encrypted data into normal string. Now we have again go to encryption decryption view file and here we have write anchor tag with ref is equal to base url function slash encryption decryption controller slash insert method. Add, and in anchor text we have write add, by click on this link page will be redirect to insert method of this controller which load insert data form on web page. So friends again have refresh page and after refresh of web page on above table we can see add button link on web page, now we have click on this link, page has been redirect to insert method which load form for insert data. So here we have fill all form details one by one and click on insert button. After click on insert button we have received data inserted message on web page and below we can see inserted data in table format, here we have store data in encrypted form and display on web page in normal string form by using code igniter encrypt library. So this way we can fetch encrypted data from MySQL database and display on web page in normal string. Now in next part we will see how can we perform update or edit operation with encrypted and decrypted data. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, Please comment your query or input in comment box or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends or even you can also share on social media also. If you want to get more update regarding our video tutorial, please subscribe our YouTube channel for get more update regarding release of future video. Lastly keep watching our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.